Capricorn, welcome to your new moon in Cancer end of June reading. Yep. What do you want to talk about? <clears throat> what do you want to talk about? Capricorn, what you got to talk about? Cappy. Get it together. Get it together. Why you want to switch too much? Why you want to listen that much? I'm not doing no hour long fucking reading. I'm oh, sure. All right, let's go. Capricorn, what you want to talk about? Hmm? Oh, now you want to talk at all? In the past position, you have the f Ten of Wands. Present position, you have the Two of Pentacles. Hmm. And in the future position, you have the Six of Pentacles. You're coming out of a place, past position. You're coming out of a place of, I want to say it was a struggle. So, you got to understand, or you, you've you come in from a place of understanding that other people's burdens is not your problem. You probably delayed actions you need to take because you were so focused on figuring things out and helping other people and it, it stunted your actions in doing things that you know you needed to take care of you were placing way too much focus energy and attention on problems that are simply not yours uphill battle for no reason carrying around other people's shit cat what the fuck Of pinnacles you're moving into a place of balance you're understanding that life <laughs> is a balancing act that's what she's standing on right you got to give time to or you're understanding that you got to give time to to every aspect of life work play love home um working on manifesting things that you want to manifest in all areas maybe you realize that you can help other people but first you have to not only help yourself but you have to be right within Future position is the Six of Pentacles. Now, I feel that you understand that. 
heavily because this is about again it's another pinnacle it's about manifesting right so i think you took or you're taking the wisdom from the past situations and you're incorporating it now as you figure shit out to manifest an excess to where you can still help the people that you were struggling to help but you're in a good place so now you can give because this 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 card represents giving it's pretty apparent it represents giving and that could be money that could be your time that could be um information that can be however you interpret it because now you're coming from a place where you're actually or you will be coming from a place because it's a future card where you can actually do that and you're not fucking yourself over in the process yeah yeah i like it queen of the moon oracle what information do we have what guidance do we have for capricorn hold on guys Hold on, guys. What information do we have for Capricorn? Oh, oh, oh. Abundance. God damn it, god damn it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If that doesn't correlate with what I was just saying. I like this card. abundance take advantage of this time of abundance it is all around you possibility and opportunity are everywhere you are open and responsive to the abundance around you there is enough for everyone capricornia affirmation is i am abundant and i surround myself no i am abundant and i am surrounded by opportunity yeah yeah the hunter moon is tra is the traditional moon of plenty it was when game was at its most plentiful so the people would not go hungry the moon was large and bright in the sky and in some cases deep orange and there was a great deal of light to go hunting well into the evening our ancestors couldn't just go off to the supermarket to buy what they needed to eat meat didn't come on wrapped trays and plastic eggs were gathered warm clothing was made from the skins of the same animals that were hunted for meat nothing was wasted this abundance was this abundance was part of a cycle just like any other it wasn't present at all times so this time of the year was to be taken advantage of while the going was good the really okay the bareness of winter would soon return hunters had to be prepared they had to have their weapons ready their tracking skills home as modern people, we are less used to these natural cycles of plenty and bareness because most of us have stepped away from growing food and the natural environment. However, these cycles are still there, even if we are not a part of them consciously. This moon normally rises in October in the Northern Hemisphere, and so was before the winter snows. Okay. You have stopped carrying other people's burdens, I'm assuming you gathered some wisdom from that. You're currently working on balancing what you have learned. You're helping others. However, you're putting yourself first as you should. You have to be right in order to help people. And from that, you are manifesting abundance clearly. And you're giving back to those now from a better state. However, you have, however, um, whatever the need for these people in your life are. You can only help people if you're right. And you're there. <laughs> God damn it. Or you soon will be. You're working at that. Capricorn is banging. You're welcome. Get off my table. Bye for now. 